Hi everyone, welcome back to Trinity Kids TV. This is your Auntie Shade here and it's so very nice of you to join us today. Now, if you're here for the first time, hi and welcome to Circle Time. We start our Circle Time by singing our Good Morning Song. So let's sing the Good Morning Song together. Let's go. Good morning, good morning, good morning, how are you? Good morning, good morning. It's nice to see you too. Good morning, good morning, good morning, how are you? Good morning, good morning, it's nice to see you too. And a very good morning to all of our friends that are watching. Now, let's say the days of the week and the months of the year. Now, we know today is Monday. It's the first day of our school week, yes. Yesterday was Sunday, so today is Monday. And yes, we are still in the month of February. But very soon, we'll be saying goodbye to February and hello to March. So let's say the days of the week and the months of the year. The days of the week are Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, and Saturday. And let's say the months of the year. The months of the year are January, February, March, April, May, June, July, August, September, October, November, and December. Yes, those are the months of the year. Now, my friends, let's find out about our weather today. Yes, and we find out about our weather by singing our weather song. Let's sing together. What's the weather like? What's the weather like? What's the weather like today, today? What's the weather like? What's the weather like? What's the weather like today? Well, is it sunny? Is it rainy? Is it windy? Is it cloudy? What's the weather like today? Is it sunny? Is it rainy? Is it windy? Is it cloudy? What's the weather like today? Well, let's take a look. Yes, my friends, it's a sunny day today. It's a bright and sunny day, right? All right, so let's talk about our color of the day. Our color of the day today is the color yellow. Yes, yellow, like our bright and sunny day. Yellow is our color of the day. Can you think of something else that might be yellow? Well, yes, mustard that you might put on your hot dog is yellow. Curry is yellow. Lots of things are yellow, right? Now, let's find out about our shape of the day. Our shape of the day today, my friends, is a heart. A heart. Can you make a heart with your hands? Heart. Now, let's find out about our letter of the day. Our letter of the day today is the letter W. Yes, we stopped at V the last time, so the letter that's next is the letter W. Can we say our alphabet together? All right, let's go. A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, O, P. Q R S T U V W X Y N Z. Great job, everyone. Now, can we think of some words that start with the letter W? Wah, wah, wah. Water. Yes. What else? What? Like the word what? Like, what are you doing today? Lots of words start with the letter W. Even watermelon. Yes, a fruit. Now, let's talk about our area of the day. 
and our area of the day today comes from Trinidad and of course it starts with the letter W our area of the day is called Wallafield yes have you ever heard about Wallafield well Wallafield is a place where you can find the Wallafield racing track and lots of people go there to watch the races and even drive their fast cars and have lots of races and lots of fun. So Wallafield is a very interesting place. I hope you get a chance to see and visit Wallafield very soon. All right, my friends, I think it's time for our number of the day. Our number of the day today is the number one. Can you hold up one finger? Yes, one is our number of the day. But can we spell the word one? Well, let's try. O N E. One. That's the word one. One has just a few letters. What can we do to count to one? Well, maybe we can do a silly dance because it's only one that we are counting to. All right, are you ready? One! Good job! We counted to one. Yes, and that was a really good job on your silly dancing. All right, my friends, now it's time for our lesson of the day. Well, I'm sure you're wondering what our lesson of the day is, and it's a really interesting one. This week, we are going to be talking about landmarks. Yes. Do you know what landmarks are? Well, a landmark is an important place or, or something that you might see in your area that will help you remember where you are. So for example, if you see the red house, you know you're in Port of Spain. That's a really nice landmark to take a look at. Now we have lots of places in Trinidad and Tobago that has really cool landmarks. One of those places might be Boko Reef in Tobago. There's also Parani Swamp in Trinidad as well. Lots of other places. So today we're gonna to learn some more about our landmarks and take a look at some of the pictures of a few of the landmarks that you might know about. Yes, so today for our activity time as well, we are going to draw, you can either draw a picture or if you have the pictures to cut out, maybe from a magazine or a newspaper, you can take a picture and put them together and make your little page with your landmarks so that you can remember all the landmarks that you might be aware of for the different areas in Trinidad and Tobago. Now today, Auntie was able to go to a landmark in Trinidad and get some nice videos and pictures for you. So I'm going to show you what our landmark of where I went over the weekend. It's Trini Kids TV and we are on the road. We just finished a hike to the ruins near Macri. Take a look at that and look at that. The breezes are blowing. We're feeling good. We had lots of fun. So if you want to come and check out the ruins in Macri, you can totally do that. It's so much fun. All right. Let's take a walk over here and let's see what we can see. And then we can sing, let's go, let's go, on an adventure, let's go, let's go, on an adventure.
was able to visit the ruins near Macri on a nice lovely hike. So stuff like that are great adventures to take a trip on with your family or your friends and take a look at the landmarks all around Trinidad and Tobago. So I hope you get cracking on your drawing and make your landmark. You can look at the pictures again and draw your landmark or cut out your landmark and put it together nicely. So that's it for our lesson for today my friends and I'm sure I'm going to see you tomorrow where we're going to talk some more about different landmarks in Trinidad and Tobago. Isn't that really interesting and fun? Alright, so I'll see you next time my friends. Bye.